Hello everyone. Welcome to Riffing Religion. I think God needs to get himself a fucking day planner, or maybe a good secretary. Uh, Harold Camping has predicted God's return in 1994 and then again on May 21st, 2011, and somehow God managed to miss both appointments. Uh, maybe he was too busy raping virgins and crucifying himself to get around to it. But anyways, not one to be dissuaded by facts and reality. Uh, Harold Camping has revised his rapture prophecy. It's now October 21st, 2011. Um, and it being now October, I decided that Riffing Religion needs to get back on track, uh, open up some cheap beers, and riff the rapture once again. Uh, Matt and I are in different uh, states right now, so we're going to do these separately. Um, Matt will post a riff video after October 21st when God leaves Harold Camping with his dick in his hands again. Uh, but for now, I present you with In the Twinkling of an Eye. In a twinkling of an eye? <laughs> no, 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 it's not that twinkling of an eye. Uh, sadly, there won't be any uh, singing midgets in this one. Uh, this is actually just a short film about the rapture that doesn't really bother with things like having a point or making sense. Um, so, anyways, enjoy. Well, as long as it's not in the twinkling of a vampire. <laughs> you gotta love the Murder Me Elmo doll hovering over him. All right. The Lord himself oh, he's dreaming of being in church. It's a fucking nightmare. Oh, what's he doing off camera? Oh, yes. Oh, Jesus. Oh, yes. Elmo. Oh, yes. All right, in 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse <laughs> Yeah, you got a big crowd today. Behold, I show you a mystery. We shall not all sleep. But we shall be changed. Well, those of us in who wear morning, diapers, anyway. In a twinkling of an eye. And I believe it is soon. Sooner than we think. Sooner than Lord last Tuesday. Descend from heaven and all <laughs> well, that's better green screen work than I saw in the Star Wars prequels. Got up together to meet the Lord in the air. What's the big circular thing in the middle? Is it a Death Star church? Does God hate Alderaan? <sighs> oh yes. Oh, Elmo. Oh yes. <laughs> I've seen more convincing animation on Aqua Teen Hunger Force. Haley Joel Osment's over there talking to these assholes. Jesus has gas. Yeah, great editing there. More great editing. Oh, I shit on the floor. Oh, oh, it's a Bible, I see. Yeah, this is what all churches should look like. Pew, 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 pew. You know, an empty church is actually a lot less boring. Elmo will devour your soul! <laughs> a peacock, huh? This guy shot for bedspreads at Super Gay Bedspreads Emporium? Oh great lord, Elmo, please rain down fire and anal cancer on my enemies. That'd be really funny if the voice of the Archangel was like, Hello, it's Rapture time! The Trump of God will sport the bad toupee of God. Starring Rob Schneider is the Lord. Ramon Ramon. <laughs> Who would name their kid And? Are the other kids named Or and Butt? Weird that all these people would actually want to be want it to be known that they were in this film. And a special thanks to Jesus for not rapturing us before we could finish our film. In fact, he's really good about not rapturing us. And a special thanks to Roll On Deodorant, so we don't have to go to heaven with stinky pits. That's Manny Ramirez's douchier brother. I'm not sure I would call it writing or directing, but whatever. Hey! Where are you going? Come back here so I can read you. Stupid fucking words.
Does this excite you?